This is a very special one minute drill. Look at this right here. 10th anniversary, it's been 10 years of Old Dominion football? Can you believe that? Year 10, here we go. How has time flown? And when you think back 10 years, what comes to mind? We opened that year against Chihuahua at home. I was just hoping we would run out this tunnel without falling down. No idea what our team would be, because you know there's no scrimmages in college football. And now here we are in year 10, and we're, we're hosting Virginia Tech this year. What has changed about Bobby Wilder in those 10 years? In those 10 years, I'd like to think I've become a little bit wiser while becoming a little bit older. Um, a really deep appreciation for being the head football coach. What is the one thing Bobby Wilder loves to do on his day off? Definitely enjoy walking the dogs, being out there with uh, with Max and Jesse, a little bit of quiet time. They could care less if we had a good practice, bad practice, did we win, did we lose, just dad's home, let's go for a walk. What's the one movie that if you had to say, you know what, give me one movie to watch and I'm good? For some reason I always end up back at Bruce Willis and Armageddon. I mean, God, <laughs> we're saving the world here, people. Bobby Wilder's asked to save the world, what's his superpower? Uh, the ability to fly. Yeah, the ability of that way it could get somewhere quickly, like Superman. They could get around the world, could reverse the rotation if need be. Uh, but the ability to fly anywhere in the world. What are the memories that stick out? You know, mm -hmm. the, the, the ones that give you the most joy, the ones that you think about first when you think about Old Dominion football over the last 10 years? Uh, they would all have to do with um, games that have been played here in the stadium. The first game against Chihuahua, the first home game against William and Mary, the atmosphere. I it, literally on the sideline had tears in my eyes with just the crowd, how loud it was, beating JMU at home, hosting playoff games. I know I'll have that same feeling this year when we, when we host Virginia Tech. You got one message to give to the Monarch Nation, the 10th anniversary one minute drill message. What's the message to Monarch Nation? The message to Monarch Nation would be thank you for nine phenomenal years. Let's make number 10 even better.